we were known as the show that if you invited us to the Emmys or you invited us to the Golden Globes or the Screen Actors Guild, Guild Awards, we were the last to leave. Looking back on the, the years of 24, when you look back and when you think about it and it comes to mind, are there any particular memories or moments that stick with you? Great days, difficult days? On 24? Yeah. It's kind of, that one's a blur. That was so labor intensive and for so many years. The cast and crew, and this always sounds trite, and, and I don't really say it about a lot of things, but they were like family. We worked five days a week, sometimes six, no less than 12, usually about 14 hours a day for eight years, nine months a year. I think we had 30 some odd weddings, marriages, some people both on the show or, or another. I think some 40 some odd children were born. Wow. Uh, the get togethers were amazing. <laughs> we would occupy a couple tables at the bar and I'm talking 40, 50 of us and we would be the last to leave. They would be folding up the chairs and we'd still be there. We really enjoyed spending our time together. And so when you ask that, the singular thing that I remember was saying goodbye. And I remember uh, Guy was doing a handheld shot camera operator who I literally loved what I considered dancing with. He did so much handheld work. He was like my dance partner. And I knew it was the last shot. I knew we had it. We did one more. Uh, I knew we had that too. And I'm not a crier. And I went, he finished it and he took the camera off and they said, cut, that's it, we've got it. And I extended my hand and wanted to say it's been an honor. Couldn't get it out. <laughs> I can't get it out now. So that's the thing that I really remember was how much those people meant to me. Uh, and I probably didn't let them know enough how much they did, but they did. And it was the thing that I missed the most. We all spent eight years trying to finish this thing. And we finally did. And I had a girlfriend at the time and I would have thought, you know, oh my God, I can, I can sleep in, I can do whatever I want. I would have been so excited. I was lost for about a year. It was like the worst breakup I've ever had. It was very bizarre. It was like I, withdrawal. Yeah, and I did not expect it. That caught me by surprise. Hey everybody, don't forget to like this video and leave a comment if you enjoyed it or if you didn't enjoy it. And for more of the Jess Cagle interview, click on the subscribe button down here. We've got plenty of other great videos for you too. Check them out by clicking on one of these links.